What up, y'all? It's your boy Nate Jackson, and this is Is It True? Americans can pass the citizenship test. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? The ones on sale. You have the right to remain silent. This should be a black citizenship test. Name two rappers from Compton. I was not the best at taking tests. I, I think that's why I got a longer neck because I was always trying to like look it off at someone else's paper. I'm great with multiple choice. I'm very nervous about this. There's just a lot of white space on this paper. From what I understand, the citizenship test is difficult. My favorite subject in school was history, so I'm super excited about taking the U.S. citizenship test. <laughs> why does the flag have 13 stripes? Easy, because 13 is the lucky number. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? For the first 13 colonies. The 13 original colonies. For original 13 colonies. Uh, name one of the two longest rivers. Uh, okay. Mississippi River, right? That's a, that's a river. The Colorado River, that's one. Don't know the second one. There's one. No, those are mountains. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna go with Mississippi because I'm from the South. Okay, uh. What are two cabinet level positions? Normally this would be something I don't know, but because I've been watching uh, the president so close, education is Betsy DeVos and she's an idiot. Ben Carson, this nigga's over housing and urban development. This fool said that the slaves were just hardworking people. Like they were like, oh, I had a hard day. I'm, I'm cool, I'm working tomorrow. And somebody said, oh, you got some time off to come in, so it's all good. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Uh, the Atlantic Ocean. <laughs> Loud and wrong. The Pacific Ocean. The Pacific, I didn't write it. Okay, in my defense, I'm from Florida and I have been around the Atlantic Ocean like a lot. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic. These are the questions to get in here? You gotta know where to swim? What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Boy, I know that has something to do with Lincoln. I'm gonna say that, fr that freed the slaves. I'm gonna go with that. Freed the slaves. I'm gonna go with equality. Because in a sense, it probably was. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Bear arms, everybody's strapped, especially in Texas. We'll say freedom of speech. Seems like they kind of defeat each other. Like you're allowed to say anything you want and everybody got a gun. <laughs> it's not going to end well. Can I get a hint in the back? Hold on, it's like, in the, oh, pursuit of happiness. No, living in the United States, you have the right to remain silent. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? See, this is the type of shit that I'm like, what does that have to do with me? You know what I mean? Man, I'm, man, I'm just gonna put Paris. <laughs> I don't know if that's... The one that was on sale. Louisiana Purchase? If I'm not mistaken, like a really good deal too. They got it for like $50. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? I have no idea. Uh, I'm just gonna write Valentine's Day. February 14th. October 16th. Sounds about right. I know this because, well I ain't gonna say it on camera, but I know it's April 15th for sure. I know that. It's like file your taxes April 15th, unless it falls on a weekend, like just last time, so it was like the 18th. What is one power of the states? I mean, they got a lot of powers. They can kind of do whatever they want. Shit, repo your car? This is way easier with multiple choice. Power to vote, let's go with that of the state, okay, a power that belongs to the states. That is true, because some are federal, some are state powers, education belongs to the states. I do know that. That's what we should have asked. There should be a black citizenship test. Question one, uh, name two rappers from Compton. 
right? And then they could pick the game, Kendrick, uh, Dr. Dre, uh, Easy E, and they had AIDS. Uh, number two, who's the only president that mattered? Right? And they'd be like, Obama. Okay, I'm all done. Can I get my grade, please? Nine out of ten. <gasps> Nine out of ten? That means it's not 100%. You got a three out of ten. Three? Man, I gotta take my ass to Canada. I gotta go hang out with Drake and become a ting. Eight out of ten. Oh, shit, that's a B. I'm gonna put eight out of ten on here right now. And then we're gonna put an asterisk. I feel like this, whatever you think I didn't get is gonna be some bullshit. Seven out of ten. Oh, okay. That's, that's, hey, that's passing. That is passing. 70? Cool. What do I need to, to become a citizen? Is that the right, like, can I become a citizen? Is that, is there even a, a grade to become a citizen? Like, do you know 100? So what's that, which one did I miss? What's the other one? When am I supposed to have my taxes done? I didn't even pass, and I live here freely, thinking I own the place. I shouldn't even be allowed at a Target or a Walgreens. Nine out of 10 though, I'd like to know in comparison though to the other test takers. 